Let's talk about dynamic properties in PHP 8.2 because they're deprecated. Let's take a quick look at what dynamic properties are first. Let's say we have a class called empty class and it doesn't have any properties whatsoever. Next, we'll create an object of that class and we'll act like it has a property called dynamic. And so this is a dynamic property, a property that is added to an object even though it wasn't originally declared in the class. Now, dynamic properties don't have a type, they're always public and running this code in PHP 8.2 will show a deprecation. Now, keep in mind, a deprecation warning doesn't mean that our code is broken. It's a warning that something will change and break in the future. Still, it is a warning, so let's take a look at how to deal with that. The first option is to simply turn off deprecation warnings. And this is something you should always do in production anyway, because deprecation warnings are helpful messages for developers, but you don't want those messages to be shown to your end users in production. So as you can see, our code runs just fine and dynamic properties still work as expected. Now, disabling deprecation warnings really isn't a long-term solution. Once dynamic properties are removed from the language, uh, this code will break and there's nothing you can do to prevent that. So let's look at other solutions. We can, for example, just add the property. Maybe you forgot to declare it originally. Maybe there's a typo somewhere in your code. If you're able to add the right property on the class or fix your typos, well, that's the easy fix, right? But what if you want to use dynamic properties? Now, personally, I would suggest that if you're relying on them to look into alternatives, but I don't know your code base, I understand that you cannot simply change everything today. So if all else fails, there are still three ways of allowing dynamic properties on an object. The first one is by extending standard class. And the reason this works is because classes that implement magic getters and setters won't be affected by this deprecation. And luckily, standard class already implements those methods for you. The second solution, you might have guessed it, is by implementing magic getters and setters yourself. You're essentially saying, hey, I know what I'm doing and I'll manage dynamic properties on my own. Lots of frameworks rely on PHP's magic getters and setters and the dynamic properties deprecation won't have any effect on them. The final solution is by adding the allow dynamic properties attribute on the class itself. This is probably the easiest way of avoiding deprecation warnings without having to make any changes to your code besides, of course, adding an attribute. So those are deprecated dynamic properties. Don't panic if you run into them. They are in fact just warnings. They don't break your code. They try to help prepare your code for the future, which I would say is a good thing. Let me know in the comments what you think about deprecated dynamic properties and also check out this other video I did about all new features in PHP 8.2. See you there.